Hi there, I'm Evan. I'm the creator of Turbo VPB. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use Turbo VPB's two-click texting functionality, which you can use to send people follow-up text if you don't get through to them when you're calling, or if you had a good conversation with someone and wanna send them any follow-up information or links or something like that. So on the left, you can see I have Chrome with Turbo VPB already installed, and I'm on a virtual phone bank page with a bunch of fake names and numbers. So I'm gonna go up here, there is a puzzle piece icon in the toolbar, which is the extensions menu. I'm gonna pin, you can see I have Turbo VPB here. I'm going to pin it so that I can always access Turbo VPB easily. And in order to get to the two-click texting settings, I'm gonna click this two-click texting button. So now I'm in the extension options. Here we see automatic text replacement. So Turbo VPB will automatically replace the keyword your name with your name. So in this case, I'll put my name and it will replace their name with the contact's first name. So here we have a couple of message templates and we can add as many as we want. So first we'll add a label and I'll call this one the didn't get through message. And we can send this one if we didn't get through. So we'll put a little message here. Hi, their name. This is your name. And you can say what organization you're from or why you tried calling, etc. And in this case, we're also going to check this checkbox that will make it so when we send this message, Turbo VPB will automatically save the contact result as texted and load the next person. So we can go through our list super quickly and we can add as many messages as we want. So I'll add another one that's the more info. And we would just say great chatting, their name, etc. And now let's go back over to our virtual phone bank. So you can see the Turbo VPB QR code here, and I'm gonna go ahead and scan it using my camera, which you can see on the right. When I open the Turbo VPB page, now below the blue call button, there are two more buttons. So you can see I can send the didn't get through message and send more info. So when I tap the send didn't get through message, it pops open my normal messaging app with, their, with the message already pre-filled. So it's already got the person's phone number and the message with their name filled in and all I have to do to send it is just tap send. Now when I go back, because I had checked that extra select texted option, it's already loaded the next person's contact details. So if I wanna call them or send another text message, I can do that. And I'll just show you sending that other text message like that. And that's it. Happy calling.